the Oates Institute is a multidisciplinary educational institute. Um, it focuses on spirituality, ethics, healing, the whole person. Well, the Oates Institute had carried on the legacy of Wayne uh, Oates's work and his tradition by offering workshops and conferences, for example, on hope, one coming up on forgiveness. Wayne's legacy was that he was a broad, broad thinker. Um, Wayne crossed bridges so that he worked at the medical school, he worked at the seminary, he really sought to get disciplines to converge so that they could impact the healing process more effectively than any single discipline could do. If I had to summarize the uh, legacy of Wayne Oates' tradition in one sentence, it would be that the marriage of the behavioral sciences with the faith traditions. Wayne Oates' legacy is still important today because we have a great need for what I think was one of his great powers, and that was acceptance. The Oates Institute is so many different things. Of course, it's the preservation and the passing on of Dr. Oates' writings and teachings and um, the very basis of pastoral counseling. Um, but it's also bringing all of that into the future and bringing along new people uh, and new ideas and dispersing them. The Oates Institute is an organization that provides resources of all kinds, uh, seminars, self-study modules, books, dialogue, discussion groups. The Center for Oates Studies consists of the 57 books by Wayne Oates, plus his articles, his uh, publications, his lecture notes, and they're all available here at the Oates Institute for ongoing study and research. I mean, you can pick almost any topic in the, in the field of pastoral care and counseling and you can find a book that Wayne wrote something about. Through the Center for Oats Studies, we are republishing many of these books, along with digitizing his papers, his lectures, and his interviews in order to make his wisdom available to pastoral caregivers. The Oats Institute is able to filter, uh, put together the best, and provide online, just-in-time, convenient educational opportunities to help caregivers uh, as they deal with hurting people. I think the thing that sets the Institute apart from other such educational initiatives is two things. Uh, the subject matter, the kind of material that we work with online with participants, but more important is the process. Connected learning, a concept that I think is truly unique with Oates Institute. I was asked to lead a module on the core competencies for uh, ministers and lay people around alcoholism and, and drug abuse. The depth of involvement and responses and experiences made it a very invigorating and stimulating uh, conversation and with some significant learning on my part and, and the participants' part. I had a wonderful time with the Pastoral Care Specialty Online Program. I like the way they communicated with each other as well as with me and how the things that they had to contribute were quickly picked up by their colleagues. It was an excellent forum for the learning of pastoral care. There is real community formed. There is immense trust and confidentiality. I found that there are things on there for pastors, for ministers, for counselors, for therapists. As long as the goal is to care for other people, you'll find it uh, at the Oates Institute. Every congregation needs good leaders. And I think that uh, the seminars and the things the Oates Institute offers along that line would be very beneficial to any church leader. Uh, there's an entire program based on lay ministry uh, that prepares people uh, in the local congregation specifically for working with individuals within the church setting. It's such a wealth of resources and it's at your fingertips from your computer, whether your church is in a city or out in the rural area. Pastoral ministry is a daily application of action and reflection. 
and the the institute provides the online resources or in-person resources that uh, helps me as a pastor and colleagues of mine. But then when we get into parish ministry, we see that we need, we have some handles on things, but we need to open them up better. And the Institute does that for people. Uh, you know, it provides the opportunities for continuing to grow. I think the OS Institute is a wonderful resource for nurses. And I think it's a wonderful resource because it's such a natural fit. Nursing is about caring for the whole person, and the OS Institute is about the very same thing, the whole person, mind, body, and spirit. My experience with the Health Ministries program was very positive. I needed um, background, theology, uh, and just uh, everyday experience with it, and this provided it. Uh, many hospital chaplains work alone as ministerial professionals in their hospital. The Oates Institute provides a ready-made, ready-to-go community that's in collaboration, that's in dialogue, uh, that they can reach out and touch and communicate with daily. The Oates Institute particularly helps pastoral counselors by providing the online seminars and continuing uh, education. It gives them the information that they need, makes it readily accessible. I give my time and energy to the Oates Institute because I believe it fills a gap that nothing else is filling now. The Oates Institute has already impacted the lives of many people in so many different ways and so many different venues. It's important to support institutions like the Oates Institute that are working across grain, that are taking a more holistic approach, so looking, looking at information from various perspectives and not through one narrow lens. The Oates Institute supply some things that universities, colleges, and seminaries just cannot supply. The most important thing to me is the interdisciplinary conversation. What we have is desperately needed by laypersons and pastors and caregivers uh, uh, all over the country, literally all over the world. I would encourage anyone who is really interested in spiritual things, in holistic spiritual things, that they will find great returns from whatever gift they make to the Oates Institute. The Oates Institute is not an endowed entity, so it's important for people to realize this, and they need to know that their membership is important, the monthly contribution is important. It's certainly a good investment as far as I'm concerned. If a person wants his or her life to be meaningful, then he or she or I want to participate in that which is greater than ourselves. The Institute is greater than any one individual. It really is casting God's hope into the world. My hope for the Oates Institute is that we'll be able to continue the legacy in terms of working and expanding our ministry. Dr. Oates's legacy was, is irreplaceable, immeasurable, unmatchable, but it's not the end and ideas keep developing and we, we need to broaden our base as much as possible to bring those ideas in and to others. Nothing is free, everything costs something, and the OS Institute costs something to run. And we need people's support to help us uh, continue the mission. It's just that simple.